Hey everybody, it's Lenny LaRocca with the LaRocca Real Estate Group. Listen, I read a very interesting article today. It has to do with what determines the value, the, the values of real estate. So there's a couple of key factors that we have to watch. As you can see, I've got my notes in front of me here. And there are, there are some five or four primary headings that I'm gonna read to you real quick. One is the real estate factors, which I'm gonna cover with you in a second. The economic factors, right? Location factors, which I know you all know. And of course, specifics to your home. So real quick, the real estate factors that have an impact on the value of home prices in today's market. Uh, supply and demand, right? As we know, we're in a very demanding market. There is limited supply and there's high demand right now. So right now we're seeing prices raise, raise up in any market across the US. Um, number two, which really is the same uh, category, is how are the comparable sales for similar homes like you and uh, what are they selling for in today's market? Obviously, everybody knows that the market is going up. I think it's probably fair to say in most major cities within the U.S., we've uh, increased equity uh, double digits just in the last 12 months, 12 plus months. Uh, economic factors, job market, right? Of course, we're in a very interesting economic time, so job market has a lot to do to spark the local economy. Uh, number two, uh, population growth. And the reason why that's key in today's market is because we know there's a lot of people that are leaving some of your higher expensive states, like we're here in Southern California. California is a pretty expensive state to exist in. So we see a lot of people, if you will, migrating out to some of the surrounding Midwest uh, states. Uh, cost of borrowing, which is an economic factor. And as we all know, we're at historical low interest rates. Even today, after about two weeks of having an uptick in the, in the uh, mortgage rates, we're still around three, three and a quarter, depending on um, if it's a new purchase money, if it's refi, and depending on the credibility of the borrower. Um, location factors. Uh, number one, schools. If you have teenage kids, or teenage school age kids, excuse me, uh, schools are very important in driving um, the population to buy in those certain areas. Uh, zoning regulations. Now, I can go into a lot of different categories here in zoning, but here in the state of California, as you know, we have some new, what we call ADU laws, uh, accessory dwelling unit laws, and those came into effect in January of 2020. And I can review those with you if you'd like to get more information, give me a holler back uh, when I give you my number at the end of the video. Uh, number three, the commercial businesses. What's going on in the local economy relative to new business coming into that area, or possibly businesses going out? We had a very large uh, car manufacturer in our area move out of town a couple of years ago. I won't say who it is and what uh, state they went to. Texas. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't say that. Um, also, uh, what is, uh, uh, what's important is the location to the city that offers, you know, trails, nature parks, parks for the kids to play in. That's important. And then the fourth category talks about the specifics to any home. Uh, usable square footage. What we're seeing in today's day and age with the pandemic going on, a lot of people are working from home. Kids are Zooming uh, their schoolwork from home. So we have a lot of clients that are actually coming to us wanting to increase the size of their home just because everybody is homebound, if you will. Um, a th second factor on your home is, you know, the age of your property and the condition of your property. As we all know, it's real good to uh, try to stay on top of your maintenance for the property, keep it freshly painted, uh, any other upgrades that you can do, it helps. So when you ultimately decide to sell your property or to step up by a bigger home, better location, or to step down by a smaller home in a different location, all these uh, variables become important. Um, number three, uh, renovations and updates. We just kind of talked about that, so we'll keep two and three together. And number four, curb appeal and landscape. And believe it or not, in today's day and age, what's real important is what your home looks like from the curb. So please make sure that your landscaping is good. If you add those four variables together and all the details that I've gone over, all those will have an impact on you know, your home value. These are the key reasons as to why properties are going up. So the last thing I wanna share with you is that obviously maybe through watching this video, your curiosity is about is what's your home worth today. You know, give us a call here at La Rocca Real Estate, 310-698. 6444, 310-698-6444. Give us a call, let us know what you'd like. We'd be happy just to email you uh, a home value. And also, by the way, we have a couple of really great monthly services that send you an automatic home value every 30 days 
without our intervention. It's not as accurate as what we can do for you, but it's a good start. We look forward to talking to you real soon. Lenny LaRocca, LaRocca Real Estate Group, 310-698-6444. Have a great day.